Hey, this is TJ from TJOnTheRoad.com coming to you today talking about the new Kemper Rig Manager 3.0 Beta, otherwise known as the editor. It's out, it's awesome. Everybody's been waiting for this right here. Let's check it out. Okay, so here we are, boys and girls. It is the Kemper Rig Manager version 3.0, otherwise known as the editor. It's out just today, and it is looking awesome now. I'm looking at this myself for pretty much the first time. So we're going to go through it together and uh, see what we find. So some things look familiar, such as the Librarian up in this section here. These are all my rigs over here. And all the tags look the same, but the new stuff is down here on the bottom. So what you have here is the rig, and then you have all the uh, normal rig button uh parameters the panorama the transpose uh the delay and the, and the reverb balance the rig volume uh whether or not it's uh, spillover is on or off and the volume pedal the input locations oh that's cool there and you have the range and the tempo set awesome awesome stuff here uh then we can go over here to the input Okay, so you have the also the, the clean sense, the noise, a gate, the distortion. Okay, you can select the source. Ah, that's great. So we go over here. And then you have your effects chain. So you have the compressor. You can turn that on or off here. Or I think you can just double click it. Yep. On or off. And you have the different uh, ones here. And if you don't like the compressor in that slot, you can click this window here and pick another. Or you can uh, click the icon here. Pretty cool. Looks good. All right, well, let's, turn, let's go over here. This is, uh, I got a muffin here. So let's see. Click on here. You got all that. We can turn that on or off. And you have the different uh, parameters for all that right there. Okay. You can turn that one off. We'll turn the compressor off too. Just to make it look simple. Next one up here is I got a screamer. The green screen. And all the parameters are set up there. How awesome is that? Uh, and again, you can change it if you want. Alright. We'll turn that one off. The flanger. I got set up in here. All the parameters are set up for that, all on one page. That's great. No menu paging and stuff like that. That's going to be a lot faster. Uh, and then here's the stock section. Ah, oh, man, everything's all on one page. This is awesome. The gain, the bass, the middle of the treble, the definition, the power sag. Ah, oh, I love this. This is great. All right, and we go to the cabinet. So you have the high and the low shift, the character, the pure cabinet. Etc. with the EQ, we turn that on. Wow, you got all the EQ parameters in one. This is one thing I always wanted to see because it was always so difficult to page through and see where everything else was. This is awesome. What I got over here, I got a chorus on this pre on this uh, profile. And delay. Wow, you got all those parameters in one screen. That's so great. That's the coolest part of this right now, as far as I can see. Other than the fact that it works. <laughs> and the reverb. Okay, and you have the output section. That's great. It's going to be very helpful, you know, particularly when you're remastering, uh, excuse me, uh, reamping things. So this is awesome. And you have the ability to duplicate it, and you can store it in your local library or store it on the profiler. Really awesome job, Kemper. I know a lot of people have been waiting for this, and I think uh, I think it looks great. And it only can get better from here, too. I'm sure they'll do some updates. So this is just a quick look. Uh, right now, I think we're going to have to get to some playing, make some new profiles. Well, hey, that's it. The Kemper Rig Manager 3.0 Beta. I want to congratulate Kemper for getting this out and all their hard work. I'm sure that everybody's going to love it. I think it's awesome. And I want to take a time to thank you for watching this channel. Please do subscribe. Uh, thank you for your support. Thank you for watching. Check out more on tjontheroad.com.